I got Lefty back here. I told you I'd want to check and see if he's got any pain in his back. He's kind of acting like he does. So I've got some tools I'm going to go through and I'm going to use pretty much all of them. Um, I've got a shockwave here that um, this is something that you're going to have to have a vet use. Um, we've got our, our vet got us licensed to use this thing. We, you know, I've been trained how to use it, know how to use it. But um, this is a great, great tool. We've got laser, we've got cryo, we've got uh, massage. We've got quite a few things that we can throw at this to see if we can't make Lefty feel a little better. So just assuming with a lead change issue that once you figure out that you know, you're not sure it's a training thing, you're checking to see if their back's sore, you just take your fingers and rub it right along either side of their spine. Like you can see them reacting a little bit right there. And really reacting all across that top line. Try to do it again to repeat, but see, I'm not using my nail. That definitely acts like that bothers him. And I'm gonna take my fingers right along. Make sure you don't stand behind him so you don't get kicked. I just kinda kinda scratch him softly. You see right right about here, he acts pretty sore right there. So I kinda got a target on what I can go try to work on. It's right here, and that's what my shockwave's so good for, and my laser cryo, all these things I have are really good for this. Is it a cold laser? Hot, it's a class four, no, it's a, it's a hot laser. It, I can turn it down, but it's it's a high power, it's a high power deal, and it just and I'll do that, I'll do that before, I'll do the laser before we go to ride him, because that'll kind of warm the back up. I'm gonna hit him with this, uh, I'm gonna hit him with the shockwave right now though. Wave. I'm gonna hit him with the cryotherapy. Try to quiet this back down, and then before Janice gets on, we'll hit him with the laser and the massage to kind of wake that back up and kind of get it warmed up and ready. I think he likes it. No, no, that's good. Now I'm gonna use the cryo and then wash. All right, put this bad boy over here. Let me get the cryo. the little green one. It must be in the other box. Yeah, I only, I only took the one out. We'll have to get the, I'll have to go get the trailer. What's missing? Uh, there's a little O-ring that goes right here and it plugs into the tank. That uh, We've got two of these cryo guns and the other one's in the trailer, so we'll have to run back and grab that. And just come back and hit it. This is a really cool tool here. What does it do? Just like super freezes or yep. like real specific spots? S specific, just blows right in a certain spot. So we'll cool that back down. So I hit the shock wave, that um, it's sound waves, it's gonna, it's gonna stimulate the body's blood flow. There's a, you can dive into as deep as you want as to what it does at a cellular level and blah, blah, blah. But uh, it's got an analgesic effect as well. Then I'm gonna hit it with the cryo just to try to get that inflammation down, cool that back down. Then when we go to warm him up, or when we go to saddle him, I'll hit him with the laser, hot laser, that's gonna warm everything up, um, those muscles up, and then hit him with this uh, equimassager that 
um, we got just a one people use and uh, hit those muscles and then get on and then go trot them a bunch and that should be that's about all we can do to try to help that back warm up I think that's what's going on but we don't know till we get on and uh, and, and try it and see